So I, I recently saw a clip from a video of a debate with uh, Christine O'Donnell in it. And um, in this debate, she makes the argument that uh, school boards should be able to be free to, to decide curriculum, even if that includes creationist material. I mean, this has all been covered, of course, before, but uh, I think it's interesting that she's apparently ignorant of the fact that there have already been court rulings on this, like board, Brown versus Board of Education. Um, and this has been covered quite a bit. So I don't know what she's at, but I think it's interesting. At some point, she literally says, in response to a statement made by her opponent, who says there's a separation of church and state, uh, as laid out in the Constitution, she says in response, where does it say that? And there's a uproarious laughter from the crowd, and she kind of sheepishly, uh, you know, plays with her hair. But uh, what I what I thought was interesting is that we're the possibility that we're entering a, a period in American history where this kind of backward, uh, anti-intellectual thinking about our own Constitution is being at attacked from uh, a number of different directions. On the one hand, you have uh, rather fundamentalist Christians who think that this is not a, a secular government that we have and uh, not a secular uh, constitution, but rather a Christian one that uh, has been misappropriated by all the godless heathens, I guess. And on the other hand, I'm seeing more and more people who self-identify as atheists saying that uh, um, that they don't <laughs> they don't feel like uh, freedom of religion is an important val uh, an important thing to, to fight for vis-a-vis uh, -vis the, the the whole Muslim thing that's going on you know with ground zero they, they it's, it's just an uneasy alliance forming between and it's strange between fundamentalist Christians uh, and atheists on the subject of uh, Muslims and uh, whether they should do this or do that and I see that quite clearly here uh, in Tennessee over in Murfreesboro where uh, right-wing fundamentalist Christians are basically picketing and protesting the building of a community center in Murfreesboro, which has, of course, about as much to do with the Ground Zero uh, controversy as as you can imagine. Anyway, I don't know. It's just it's it, to me, it's a very strange thing that uh, I'm seeing. I'm hearing from Muslim from uh, from atheists who don't think that we live in a secular society that that we all have stewardship of, but rather that they are somehow the real guardians of Western values and that the Christians don't really have a role here and that the Muslims don't have a role here, that it's just it's just free thinking atheists and rationalists and and it just boggles my mind. I mean if we continue down this road, we're we're literally gonna wind up in little little fiefdoms, little <laughs> with chieftains. I guess there'll be some sort of you know, atheist warlord, and there'll be like a Christian warlord, and I guess our country will just dissolve. I, I'm just kidding. I, I I don't think so. But I mean, it's just what is what's going on? I mean, what the heck is going on with people? Anyway.